Hi everybody, welcome back to Borderlands 2. My name is Mikey Dubs and today we're taking Gage through the ultimate randomized rogue lance. Let's get this job done. In the last episode of the ultimate randomized rogue lance, what did we learn? We learned that when you're fighting Pyrope, and excuse me, hello? <laughs> My loot? <laughs> uh, we learned that you gotta watch out for those... F for those railings that potentially save you from Pyrope, but at the same time can also, if you're using an explosive weapon, Get you killed so we're gonna grab some grenades and maybe a shield here that's actually useful or maybe a bandit launcher to throw in slot four for the time being but let's start seeing what we get for the actual randomized guns our first randomized gun is actually not so bad it's quarter of a million damage with a fire rate of 16.8 which is extremely fast and a hundred round magazine size let's go ahead and equip that into our inventory yeah i think it's gonna be quite good our next gun is an infection cleaner. It's banded. It's got a high damage, not quite a milli. It's about two thirds of a million damage, but a nice high fire rate as well. Can't be too upset about the first couple guns, except this one looks like it's a little bit fake though. It doesn't, look, it doesn't look like it's actually going to land and do damage. Sniper rifle damage, corrosive damage, and strength relic. Now what I'm trying to still learn is when I get these relics in here, they seem to always change. So like all the relics, regardless of which ones I equip, seem to never be what they actually read when they're on the ground. So you just kind of grab them, see what they turn into, and then make your decision from there. Hop up here, looking for bigger and better guns, please. Okay, grenages. Uh, what manner of you that can summon up fire without flint or tinder? Sticky longbow meteor shower. I have a feeling that it might actually be good. It's sticky, um, it's longbow. Is it gonna no it doesn't actually meet your shower Just tough. Okay. I think that's gonna be it for our starter loot Let's go ahead into our randomized skills and see if we get anything game breaking to start off here Okay off rip I'm not seeing anything too crazy good. I'm looking at all three skill trees Doesn't look like anything that's gonna be that good for us. However, we do Have a chance to maybe get maybe reaper as far as a tier one skill goes, Reaper is really good. Well, I feel like guns is really good as well. Why don't we take Reaper for five points? Thanks, Maya, for the extra gun damage. And we're gonna use this the slag SMG, this social projectile convergence for the 16.8 fire rate to go out there and get the kill. So we we completed tier one in our last round with zero. But we did not manage to kill pyrope which is sad come on let's get this kill here both of his legs are hiding inside the zone though we need death trap out here okay our shield is gone but i see a juice house candy i kind of want to grab it yeah 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 yep. ow 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 run 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 okay we get it we get a little bit of health regen going Sla smack this rabbit skag thank you he really doesn't take he doesn't take any damage Except for on his leg, which is crazy. There we go, finally. Alright, smack some skags around. Oh, big old, big old barb skag trying to ruin my day, huh? Where you at? Right there. Oh, I lost my buff, though. It's okay, our SMG is actually pretty decent. We have some other guns to try here. We got shields. Looking for a big shield. That's a tiny shield. Um... I, I, these shields don't seem that great. I'll take this one, but I'm looking for something a little bit more powerful as we go along here. What's up, homie? I think this this gun's really strong. It's, it seems really consistent. Consistency is key. Its accuracy is 100, right? 96.1. That's that's really strong, especially in Hyperion. Feel good about that. It's just the ricochets that are getting me killed. Whenever I ricochet off of them. There we go. That's consistency right there. Goodbye, Fossil Skag. For Tier 1, this gun will get the job done. At least for for the foreseeable future. I need to land some crits on this guy. Okay, Rabbit Skag goes down. That's that's a nice one magazine for the Rabbit Skag. My magazine is absolutely enormous, though, still. Still. Reaper helping out a lot. All right, Rubberized Chain Lightning. Maybe this will be an actual Chain Lightning. Yes, it is. Or a Sticky Longbow Chain Lightning. They both are sick. So if I can get myself a moxie gun and couple it with this grenade, I can actually heal myself up pretty quickly, I believe. Right, let's get that trap out here. One leg, two leg, 
And looks like you always gotta do a third leg. There we go. Okay, discover you. What do we get? It's a pretty big launcher. And I don't even have four gun slots yet, so I think I take it. What do we get? Second wind health and a oh, sorry full damage, but they get re-rolled into Let's see. Sir Hammerlock's elephant gun. Not doesn't look like the very best. They get re-rolled into Assault rifle damage looks like okay. Let's keep it moving. La da dee, loot me. Yes, guns. Okay. Pretty good damage, really slow fire rate, which is tough. And I'll take it. This launcher seems okay, but is it gonna be better than my, my traditional bandit one? I don't think so. Its damage is ridiculous, though. 17 million times four that's kind of insane my infection cleaner can get replaced let's go ahead and replace this infection cleaner attack smg low damage medium fire rate yeah not good the elephant gun good for one shot but then it doesn't fire for a long time you can fire swap back fire again maybe for like a little bit faster fire rate but i can't i trust my current grenade and which is a big deal for randomized rogueland so i'm not gonna swap that up and i'm not gonna climb for the pressure plate either instead we're gonna go shock and odd to get down this tree take say velocity this is the extra gun damage bullet speed all that stuff's pretty important let's go refill my ammo please all right that trap do your thing i need to try out some more guns let's see how's this grenade doing hey that's not bad at all if I slag somebody up, the grenade will actually maybe get some kills. No crits, but it hits. Very clean. Bullet Mongs never stood a chance. Any of these guns any good? Let's see. Decent damage, but a slow fire rate. Same thing with that gun. The fire rate is really the big one, right? If you don't have a good fire rate, you don't have much of a weapon in general, so you gotta be looking at those stats when you pick up that gun. Before you before you pick up that gun, you really want oh, some actual class mods. Let's take weapon accuracy and reload speed at a base. Maybe for for right now we take extra gun damage. Because the gun damage I think is what we need more than accuracy. Let's see, a Devastator. It's Jacob's. It's high damage. It's fire rate is so slow. It says hail on it. Does it shoot like a hail? <clears throat> I see the shots landed up there. Which is interesting. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Relax. Thank you. Extra gun damage is big. I'm slagged. I'm 1 HP. And I go down. Dang. Hopefully this guy doesn't run away from me. There we go. Oh, yeah, the extra gun damage coming in clutch there. It's a Maggie. Three million damage, but launchers are just inherently bad. <clears throat> and randomized rogue lands because of their ammo consumption. SMGs and pistols are probably the best. Overall. Because you get the most bang for your buck when you use them. So looking for something to replace... See a chopper? It's got high damage, high fire rate, but when you start shooting, it probably burns the entire mag. Yep, it definitely does. <clears throat> but it's got high damage and a high fire rate. It fires once and then it goes. I, I kind of like it, actually. So we're going to keep it around. See, this T yours medium damage, medium fire rate, not taking it. Mm. I don't think I'm going to take that Thompson either. Plasma caster might scale okay. The fire rate's there, but it's just It doesn't come anywhere close to the DPS of my current gun. And that's and that's a big deal for me, personally. Okay. Let's see, did we get anything so far from our what did, what did we get? From our class, from our rewards. I'm not too sure. Alright, five points me. Velocity. I think Foresight is a decent skill, so we go for it. 
Bloodfell guns is good too. But I'm just not I don't I'm not really applying any dots. Okay, death trap, get out of here. Slag is good. Go down, homie, go down. Thank you. So we gotta try to clear these guys out. If, if you kill an enemy, they can't deal damage. Despite what you might have heard. Go. What was the what was the size on that bad boy? 1.9 milli? Not good enough. Maybe I can stagger this guy with some grenages? No, no stagger. Once he gets staggered though, I can Whoa, he's shooting rockets at me. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I think it might be a hive or something. Oh my goodness. Yeah, it's a hive. It's a hive. I can't survive it. Oh my gosh. I cannot see a thing. Wow. All that came from one enemy. Just one singular enemy. Just shot one hive one time. And it just completely ends the run. It's because you can't see. It instantly one shots you. And that's the... And that's the that's the danger of the ultimate randomized roguelands. So these enemies can have hives. They can have whatever guns they want. Okay, I'm gonna take this explosive spike shield because it's big. At, the, at this point, it's all I really care about. Radium and cash, not the best. I will take this. Just a little bit sad though, to be honest with you, to have that run ended so soon. Incendiary damage is big. Still no guns. And we get three relics that aren't going to do anything. Yeah, they all turn into override cooldown, right? That is, it's just insane how buggy the gear randomizer is. It's really cool for guns, really bad for just about everything else, though. Guns! Speaking of guns. Okay, a terrible kitten and a really bad SMG. Okay, so we didn't get anything remotely good. I might have to just use a coach gun or something. Let's go Reaper again. And let's hope. Let's just hope and pray that we can deal enough damage. Um, Bombardier can go on the bottom. This kitten might be good if I can land a shot. There we go. Some crits. It's doing kinetic damage, not, not incendiary. There we go. Should be two kills there, no? It's, it's shooting right through him. Yeah, bada bang. Bada boom. Him in the head. Nice damage, actually. Boom. Him in the head. Don't piece. I like that. Okay, some actual guns, please. See, 400. That's This is a fine omen right here. Maybe that'll be good. It looks like it's doing incendiary. Hammer Buster. Decent damage. Let's try it out. It's shock as well. That's big. We're going to open up as many chests as we can get. That's a terrible gun. Holy cow. Looks like we have shock taken care of. Shock, fire, and kinetic. I'm looking for something that's maybe some corrosive damage. Okay, let's see. Fire rate, the minus magazine size is good and bad, depending on what kind of gun you're using. If you're using something like this bandit, it might actually be kind of good. Because it's going to really push up our fire rate. Okay, I'm going to go back for the Pyrex candy. Both these guns are atrocious. The hope is that with every atrocious gun that we see, our enemies get to that many atrocious guns in return. Chopper, usually when you have a chopper, it just keeps shooting and shooting and shooting. And Bearcats are, aren't usually that good either. Let's see. Yeah, the damage is always high on them, but... It's not a big fan of them, usually. Slag Chopper, let's see. 
and it eats up all your ammo. Okay, let's see what we're gonna get. Rock kitten, Andrew seventy four thousand damage. Its dam its fire rate isn't really good enough. Another override cooldown rate. It seems like all of my relics are just gonna end up being override cooldown rate, which is a little bit sad. Okay, let's see, a swish stratifier. Terrible. No reason to try this creamer, I don't think. It's not gonna do anything for us. A heartbreaker. Its damage isn't awful. You have to reload it really a lot. Okay, this Octo seems really, really strong, actually. Really high damage, a decent fire rate. Oh, I have faith in this Octo, actually. I have faith in this Octo. And I have a little bit of faith in this Hammer Buster as well. Let's take our five. Shock and awe. And let's do velocity again and move out. I was hoping to get some robots so I can try it, try out my guns, but... Okay, good. I can just fire my guns, right? I don't have to worry about it. Looks like I'm doing shock and I'm doing fire damage, which is big. The rabbit sky never saw a chance. What in the world? This gun's pretty nice. What's this thing? It's a liquid omen. This thing's pretty nice. See a barb skag? All right, let's go see what we get for loot. I'm gonna have to swap out my my big boy here. Oh my gosh! Look at that world burn. Wow. Wow. Yeah, let's let's swap out. Let's swap out my bandit. Please work. Oh, this thing is gonna be insanely good. Look at that bad puppy. Okay, it's gonna take a really strong gun, I think, to, to 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 be better than this. Let's do let's do something a little bit tricky here. It's tricky, tr tricky, tricky, tricky. Let's go ahead and drop our relics and hope that our new relic will not be infected by those ones. Shield recharge rate and assault rifle damage. So if I go check my, they actually work. Holy cow! They didn't get infected. Unbelievable. Okay, sick. Looks like I, I might have a 1A here. A 1A weapon. I respect this launcher for what it is. A simple launcher, but I'm not going to be going it. What's up, Rex? Yeah, I get one shot. It is what it is. Godfinger and Bone Shredder. It turns into a Hector's Paradise. It doesn't seem to be that good. Okay. We go Veloz, we go Bloodfield Guns, I think. Give me just that, that bigger magazine size. The Friendship Gulag. Do I have a Corrosive Gun to try out? I do. Let's just try this, just gun out this for a second. Wow. I just got sniped for all my HP. Okay. There we go. Where are you at? Are you over here? I think my corrosive gun might be a little bit better for this zone. Oh, he's got rockets. Oh my gosh. Yeah, very dangerous enemies always. Every enemy can be extremely dangerous. You never know what they're wielding. You gotta kill them before they kill you. Look at that, Deeps, right there. Against an ultimate badass. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Okay. Looking for things that are just strong. That band, this Jolly Roger does look okay, but I think realistically with that slow fire rate, it's not going to come close. Let's go for more red chests and guns, please. Pistols are really nice, usually. Good touch, just doesn't... Its fire rate is 48. Its max size, I mean, with that fire rate, it might actually be better. Its damage is so low, though. You end up burning through so much of your ammunition. And I could just be using this SMG instead. Okay, we got a couple more things to grab, and then we can head out. Let's see. Peak opener. 
and a Triketra Doll Sniper. It's a times 16, 1.5 milli. Okay, let's... Oh, man. Too many guns to try. Too good. Maybe this omen bites the dust? I don't know. This, this gun seems pretty good. Seems pretty... Shock lightning bolt. Please be a natural lightning bolt. Yes. Good, good, good. Okay, what do you got? Max health and SMG damage. Hopefully the SMG damage stays SMG damage. I'm really hoping. Yes, good. Now my ham now my my world burn should go pretty crazy. Okay, blood filled guns, foresight, and we go next. Now our magazine size is so big that it it shouldn't really matter that we've nerfed ourselves. I really only want a shield that's bigger than my current one. Nobody survives that. That trap, go, go, keep him busy, would you? It's tricky, 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 tricky. Let's go get him. Oh yeah, with that extra SMG damage. Yep, and the fire rate coming from our class mod. Whoa, I think one of them must have had a ton of damage because he just one shot my my death trap. Like death trap got one shot. I'm happy the death trap tanked that, not me. Again, ace damage, projectiles, fire rate. Those are the things we're looking at. Strip a shield. Oh my gosh, he just came out with a launcher and just said, I'm going to hurt you. Base damage, projectiles, fire rate. Those are your main stats. Shield recharge rate and capacity or cooldown. That's a nice cooldown relic. I think maybe what we will do is we will shoot some masks. Come on, let me see it. Ow, got it. And then big mask. Hoping to maybe get something that's like, like usable for a shield. I'll take that shield. Only incendiary transfusion, it's time seven. It, it might be kind of good for me. Ooh, fire rate? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hopefully that'll be non-randomized. Kind of that's a little bit better, I think. Okay. So increases fire rate with all gun types while your shields are depleted. Or killing enemy increases your reload speed for each stack of bloodlust. Ooh, that could be kind of good. Anything else in this tree that I really want? There's reload speed in here. That's about it. How about this skill tree? Increases your gun damage for all types except for sniper rifles. Increases critical hit damage with all, but decreases your crit damage. You know what? I don't see it being that strong. Let's just go preparation. We should be having a full mag because of blood-filled guns. Okay, we have so much damage that I think we should be fine in this zone. Where are you going, homie? Where? No, seriously, where are you going? There we go. Boosting up our damage quite a bit now. And that's it. Super easy. Slow fire rate. Can't take it. Blockhead, landscaper, a hive, a, a lady fist. I'm taking, taking lady fist. Sorry. Gotta take lady fist. It's too strong. A conquering neo generator. I don't trust it. Wow, look at the damage on that hammer buster. I doubt it. It can't carry it over to the gun that actually entered my inventory, but still. Let's call Painless Power. Why not? And we're going to be getting a lot of gun damage. To couple with our fire rate, which is super nice. It's tricky, tricky. Okay, I don't, I don't have um, close enough for extra ricochets. I think I might have it in my scotcher though. Look at that, deeps. 
Plus the SMG damage. I'm definitely going to be investing in SMG... SDUs for this boss fight. Luckily, these guys don't have guns, so they don't they don't have access to randomized guns. If they did, I'd be in a lot of trouble. There's too many of them. Oh yeah, iridium me. We got a full 256 iridium. Very nice. No, it's, we don't have close enough, but we do have nth degree. In that case, we just I'm gonna go impact. More gun damage, please. Okay, let's start with SMG. Then do pistol. Because those are the two weapon types that are... I think pistols might be the most common. Okay, we go straight back to the well with Pyro Pete, which is tough. We should have enough damage to just, just straight up get through this guy. Hopefully the dot doesn't kill me as I'm trying to give him the work here. And what did we learn from last time? Come equipped with better guns. Because last time I fought Power Pete, he gave me the work. This time, not so much. Now, what I'm going to try to do is save my world burn by equipping this omen instead. Save the world burn, equip the omen, get the iridium. Oh, yeah. Get all this iridium. And hopefully the nerf apocalypse doesn't kill my own my my oh so coveted. World burn. Okay. You gotta chill out there, brother. <laughs> He's going crazy, this guy. On the tier two we go. The forest. This is the easiest one. Get me over there. Thank you. On to difficulty tier two. Enemies will get tougher, but our gear will not get stronger, which is tough. All right, so the nerf apocalypse has happened. This gun actually kind of survives. So does my Octo. My Triketra, not really. This gun definitely does not. But how about my, my world burn? I think my world burn's gone forever, yeah. But did anything in, in, in any of these guns, especially SMGs and pistols, did any of them get like a, a crazy amount of projectiles and good fire rate? I could go Lady Fist until I get something decent. This is still, this slag dog could be actually kind of good. Is this, the, is this the gun I was using before? Yeah, I think it is. I think it still could be kind of good. Apt error message. Error message. What is this gun? This gun should never drop. Um, uh, it's a little bit weird. I want to take a picture of it because it's just so strange. This gun should never drop. So what do you got? A fibber. And it has high base damage and an extremely good fire rate. Okay. This one's actually good. Let's swap out this one. Oh yeah 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 Sorry. I get excited. I get excited because the more damage guns do, the easier the round becomes. Decent gun. I don't think it's gonna be that great. All right, let's get to that last chest up there and then head out. I think this fibber is going to be the one for now that we use. Got me. I don't have close enough, which is tough. Jacob's job. Not going to be that great. Let's head out. Aider's Folly. Okay, enemies that have guns are extremely dangerous. We have to get through this round as quickly as possible. Oh my, Lanta. Oh, he's got a lot of projectiles, this guy. There we go. As long as I can hit my shot, we're fine. Okay, I want to make sure I'm, I'm landing the bullets the way they're supposed to be landed, though. Reflect them off the ground. 
Where are you at? Over here somewhere? There you are. Oh, ow. And the enemy dies right in front of me. Show. Oh, but I'm back. Oh, I'm so back. That's crazy. Oh, my grenades are reset. I don't see anybody. Oh, there you are. He got he got rinsed. Don't don't deflect. Thank you. Oh my gosh, bro. I'm getting down instantly. It's so hard to know what is going on. Oh, so what did my did my relic make it through the nerf apocalypse? It looks like all my relics are are doing a great job. Making it through the nerf apocalypse. See, cool down. Cool down, cool down, cool down, cool down, cool down. That's all that matters, I guess. Okay, let's take impact. I want Metal Storm. We're going to go Nth Degree for more ricochets, and then we're going to go Metal Storm. We're going to get a lot of fire rate going. Well, let's farm up. Let's farm up another gun if we can. This gun seems still pretty okay. For Whoa! I didn't. I need to grab that candy, I think. I think I want it. Why, I don't trust Jacobs. Fire rate? Nah. But there's lots of candies. There's a Pyrex candy there as well. Any more chests around? Back at the start where I started? Come on. Yes, got one. Okay. What gun can be replaced? This gun seems... This gun seems really good, this Fibber. So does the shotgun though too. Yeah, all these guns seem pretty good. Fire Infinity. I know I'm kind of heavy on SMGs, but I have an SMG damage relic. What do you want from me? Jacobs, because they're just because they are Jacobs, that's what gives them their high fire rate. Doesn't mean they actually are a high fire rate. This is as fast as you can pull the trigger. I can't pull the trigger that fast, so they're inherently nerfed for me. Where did those candies go? Let's get a little bit of a oh chest. Slow fire rate. Slow fire rate. High fire rate. Oh, it's a fibber. It's incendiary. What gets replaced? What gets replaced? What gets replaced? <sighs> I don't want to replace anything. Seems okay. And where are those candies at? There's one right here. Let's take this Pyrex candy and head out. Three, two, one take. Badass crater, badassitude. Let's go. I'm gonna go for. Holy cow. Nothing's gonna survive that. No way, no how. Later, kiddo. Now this is a gun. Now this, now this right here is a gun. Holy cow. Oh my gosh, you don't stand a chance. Later, kiddo. My ammo's a little bit on the low side right now, but that's okay. No need to reload. Oh my gosh, see you later. That, that fire ray is just insanely good. Drop. Pick it up. That free reload off. Oh, I should probably should have dropped that trap a while ago, but... I think I don't necessarily need them. There we go. Take five points into this left side tree. It's going to be the nth degree, then it's Metal Storm. Very good. Now our fire is going to be kicking up even faster. I think I got that iridium, hopefully. So once that first guy goes down, our fire is going to go to the moon. Pretty slow reload. But it's just so strong. It's just so strong, especially if I aim it directly at the ground. Okay, low damage, low fire rate, low damage, low fire rate. Don't want those kind of guns. This, this corrosive gun could definitely get replaced. It's, it's low fire rate. High damage, low fire rates. Yet I've imagined, like, this is a 2.28 milli gun with a 24 
rounds per second fire rate. It's just so much damage. Rabbit's Keg, you're a little bit tankier than the average laddie. I understand. And not tanky enough, trust me. Oh, when you aim down set, you only fire one bolt at a time. That's kind of interesting. Later. Oh, yeah. I love it. It's so good. Okay, let's go for Metal Storm here. Fast hands, improved reload speed, and head out. Reload speed, mag size, fire rate, all of the above. Let's see. Twister assault rifle. Slow fire rate. High damage. Very high damage. It's actually not that slow fire rate, to be honest with you. I have a lot of good fire rate skills as well. I can I can buff it up, but for right now, we don't really have a reason to swap off of our our fibber here. This is the strongest white weapon in the history of Borderlands. Oh, let's grab, let's grab a little bit of, what is that, um, extra projectiles? Holy cow. Extra projectiles. That's what we definitely don't need. But hey, it's Dimash. Open up, bad boy. Can I actually hit that guy? No. If I had close enough, yeah, I could. Where are you at, homie? Come on now. Only making this harder on yourself. There we go. Later. Oh, loot enemy. Later. Okay, Godfinger. Base damage and fire rate. Base damage and fire rate. Dolls and Jacobs are inherently nerfed. This one has pretty decent base damage and okay fire rate. Whoa! And I'm down. That's not good at all. That trap is down too. I have to walk to the edge. Come on, get me there, get me there, get me there. Ah, I'm so slow. I don't see anybody. No, and we go down. Well, we made it through a decent amount of, a decent amount of each of these runs. And we had to, got to use some really, really fun guns. And I was just, I was trying to loot and I got blown up. And the last time we died, that's how it goes sometimes. Anyways, if you enjoyed the video, hit the like button. Subscribe to see more videos like this one. And I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye.